Then we need a towel. A long band. Or even belt. How is it? Let's start with warm up. Okay. If your towel or your band is too long, you can fold it and keep it a little bit wider than your shoulders. And keep it just slightly tight. Keep your arms down. Bring your shoulders all the way up. Bring your shoulders slightly back. Right now, just relax and bring your shoulders all the way down. Again, slightly forward, all the way up, slightly back, and relax and let the gravity pull your shoulder blade down. Last one. Up, all the way back, all the way down. Right now, keep your shoulders down. Just bring your arms to your shoulders level. And keep going next time. Alternate your legs, small step back. And little by little, you can increase range of motion for your arms. Bring your hands a little bit higher, maybe your eyes level. Four, three, two, right leg, step back, stop. Straight line from your toes to your hands. Bend forward and relax. Switch, step back, straight line. Bend forward. You can do small range of motion and still warm up. Just activate some muscles. Step, bend. And last one. Great. Shake your arms. Shake your arms. Right now, keep your hands wider. Bring your arms overhead and all the way down. It should be comfortable for your shoulders. If you have a band, you can stretch it slightly, but if you have a towel, just keep your hands wide. Bring your arms around. Keep your feet a little wider. Spell is stable. Side bend. Try to feel. Your pelvis is stable, both sides are long, and your head is right in the center between your arms. Four, three, two, Last one, shake your arms. Right now, switch grip, please. Right now, reverse grip. Your palms facing up. Keep your hands a little bit wider than your shoulders. Bring your arms to your shoulders level. Keep your towel or your band slightly tight. Next time, alternate your legs, small step. Right leg step, twist to the left and center. Left leg step, twist to the right and center. Step, twist. As you twist your shoulders, you know why? Uh, slightly twist your pelvis as well, it's fine. Step, twist. Again.
And the last one. Shake your arms. A regular grip, your palms facing down. A little bit wider in the shoulders. Shoulders roll, small step to the left. So we're going to do lateral step to the right. As you do step, slightly twist your pelvis, your shoulders. Just try to elongate your spine to keep your lumbar safe. Four, three, two, stop. Bend forward. Your arms are straight, your back is flat. Keep your towel or your bent tight. Shoulder weight slightly towards the center of your spine. Protraction, retraction. With just shoulder weight sliding around your rib cage. And try to draw bottom of your shoulder blades toward the center. Mm -hmm. Four, three, two, come up slow. Right now, start your position. You're, you're sliding to the right. Step to the left and twist. And two more. Shake your arms again, bend forward. Your arms are straight right now. Draw your shoulder blade over the center, bend your elbows. Relax, relax. Shoulder blade, elbows. Relax, relax. Shoulder blade, elbows. And two more. Stop here. Stretch your arms up toward the ceiling. Bend the elbows and relax. Roll, reach, elbows down and relax. And still feel how your shoulder blades are sliding around your rib cage. Back is flat. You can bend your knees a little bit more. It should help you to feel more comfortable into your lumbar spine. Mm -hmm. Two more. Just bend all the way down and relax a few seconds. Round your back. Roll up. Awesome. Again, regular grip. Keep your hands a little bit wider than your shoulders. Alternate your work, step back. Right leg, step back. Stop. Lean to the left. Center and switch. All left leg. Lean to the right. Step, lean, and last one. Shake your arms. Right now, reverse grip. 
Rivers Reef. Shoulders roll. Again, bend forward. Bend the elbows. Stay here a few seconds. You're trying to squeeze your elbows. Same time, send your elbows back and down relative to your shoulders. To elongate your trapeze, keep your neck long and feel tension a little bit lower than your shoulder blade. And relax. Again, start to draw bottoms of your shoulder blades toward the center. And relax. Right now, stop. Reach hands up and forward. Bend your elbows. Relax. Keep your core tight to support your lumbar spine and keep your chest lifted to make it movement more effective for your spine extensors. Two more. Awesome, bend forward, just relax a second. Great, come on. Again, a regular grip. Keep your hands a little bit wider than your shoulders. Your eyes well. Bend your right elbow. Bend your left elbow. Alternative arms. On the right side, right side, right side. <clears throat> Last one, stop, right leg, step back, small step back. And as you do step forward, roll at the same time. Step back. And roll. Right leg step back and on your way up roll. Right arm is working, right leg is working. And as you bend your right elbow, try to feel how your right shoulder blade sliding down to diagonal towards your left hip. Four. Shake your arms. All right. Right now, just your left arm. Step back and roll your way up. Four, three, two, and last one. Great, shake your arms. Right now, let's switch our grip. Bring your band behind you. Your palms facing back. Put out. Right now, shoulders rolls. Up, back, down, relax. Forward, up, back, down, and relax. Last one. Bring your shoulders down, chest is lifted. Keep your arms straight. Just start to press your hands slightly back. Your fingers are still reaching down to keep your chest lifted and shoulders down. Press, 
Next time, as you're pressing your arms back, take a deep breath into your chest, into your collarbone. Inhale on your way back. Inhale. Last one. Inhale and hold. Hold the breath. Twist your head to the right, to the center. Exhale. Again, nice deep inhale. Stop. Twist your head to the right, center, and exhale. Keep going. Inhale. Hold. Try to feel, as you twist your head to the left, you're stretching the right side of your collarbone and the right side of your neck. Inhale, twist, exhale. And the last one. Shake your arms. Slightly bend both your knees, keep your towel tight, deadlift. Start your movement with your pelvis. As you bend forward, tilt your pelvis, and same time your seat bones coming up, and on your way up, your sit bones reaching back toward your thighs, toward your knees. Bend forward. Last one. Awesome. Shake your arms. So right now, if your towel or your bag is long, you can create a loop or just put one side of your bag on the floor and have other side and create some tension over here. We're going to stretch our neck muscles just to relax a little bit. Two options. Number one, just have one on the side or both sides, doesn't matter. Twist your palms slightly forward to create external rotation for your shoulder. Relax your shoulder and lean your head opposite direction and stay here a few seconds. Feel kind of like a light hint of the stretch into your neck. And relax. Inhale into your right side and lean your head to the left. Try to relax your right arm. Again, inhale into the right side. Last one. Great. Next time, twist your head to the left, twist your nose to the left. And again, take a deep breath into your right side. And relax, again, inhale. Last one. Great, switch your side. You can create a loop or just one side of your band on the floor. Create some tension over here, light tension. Twist your palm facing forward. Lean your head to the right and take a deep breath into your left side. And back, and again, take a deep breath into your left side. Last one. Right now, twist your head to the right. Again.
Awesome. Take your bend. Again, bring your bend behind your back. Palms facing the back. Keep it slightly tight. Shoulders back and down, chest is up. Rise your hands back as you do inhale. Right now, you may have a little bit more freedom around your neck and around your shoulders. As you're pressing back, inhale and bend forward at the same time. Bend forward, stop. Back is flat and pause. Still reach your hands back and down, relax up to your shoulders. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And come up slow. Shake your arms. Regular grip, your palms facing down. Big shoulders strong, bring your arms. Arms almost all the way up over your head and alternate your legs, step back. Try to feel connection between your lower ribs and your lower abs. Bring your arms as high as you feel comfortable, both your shoulders and your neck. You can stop your bend slightly in front of your eyes. Right now, right leg, step back. Twist your pelvis around your left hip joint and relax. Left leg, step back. Twist your pelvis around your left hip, right hip joint. Alternate your legs, small step back. Twist, twist. Step, twist, twist. Step, twist. Standing leg is still, but you're twisting just your pelvis and your shoulders. Last one. Shake your arms, relax the neck. Switch your grip again, reverse grip. Palms facing up. Single bend and double bend. Bend. Roll. Right now, try to create a little bit less tension around your shoulder blades. So let them move. Back is flat. Maybe bend your knees a little bit more. It should help you to keep your back flat. Relax back of your neck and keep your eyes down. Ladies, chin slightly, slightly up, slightly, slightly up. Keep your neck in line with your thoracic spine. Melt your shoulders back and down, two more. Bend all the way down, all the way down. And roll up. Right now, keep your palms, uh, keep your hands shoulders apart. Twist your right palm towards you and left palm. One more time, keep it tight. Twist and twist. Right now, your palms facing you. Bring your elbows, your shoulders level. Triceps press. Eyes are like your elbows and just press forward. Hold. 
four, three, two, last one. Stop, bend your elbows. And right now, small movement, just open your forearms. If you feel that your bend is too tight, you can open and grab just one. Mm -hmm. Also, kind of isolate your elbows, your palms facing up. Try to feel rotated calf muscles. Eight, seven. Great. Shake your arms. One more time. All right, go rip, twist, twist. Option number one, keep your elbows in front of you. Option number two, keep your elbows even higher over your head. We're going to do triceps, overhead press. So find your own comfortable position. From here, to here and just press. We just changed our starting position, but the idea is the same, activate your triceps. Here it's a little bit easier, here it's a little bit harder. Press. And again, it should be just harder for your triceps, not for your neck. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, press. Shake your arms, again, switch. Single, twist, twist, your palm facing up. If you have a towel, don't worry, just slightly Press your hands outwards, create some light tension. It's also more than enough. So start to twist slightly outwards and try to feel that you're trying to activate the back of your shoulder instead of front of your shoulder. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and last one. Great. Shake your arms. Awesome. Right now, your towel or your band on the floor and your feet. Find the ends of your towel. Keep your arms straight, just round your thoracic spine and your lumbar spine. Create some tension over here. Imagine you want to extend your back. Right now, just relax and bring your body all the way down. One more time. Stretch out your bend or create some tension to your towel. Open back of your neck. Allow your shoulders sliding down. Stretch space between the shoulder blades. And relax. Awesome, relax, place your hands on your knees and roll up slow. Shoulders roll, shake your arms. Pam, 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 pam. How do I feel? 